It's been raining a lot where I am, so maybe it's the perfect time to talk about storm and omega-level mutants. One of the more important discussions during the Hickman era was this ranking or this qualification of certain mutants being listed as omega level and what that really meant. The key component here is not that they are supremely powerful. Instead, what omega level really means is that they have an ability that can't be registered at its highest peak. So in the case of somebody like Jean Grey, she would be a mutant who is omega level in her telepathy, meaning her ability to speak with people using her mind has no upper level. Somebody like Bobby Drake or Iceman is an omega level mutant when it comes to controlling temperature because there doesn't seem to be a limit to what his power can do. There are several really important mutants who make the list as omega level for one ability or another. I've discussed a few of them in some of the previous videos we've made, including two of the resurrection 